this game. Oh, the awesomeness. The music. The gameplay. It's nice. And immediately we get the power up. Power up. But if you didn't know, those trees are actually spikes. Yes. Dangerous, dangerous spikes. Oh, I shudder. This is perhaps the least forgiving jump in the game. Coming right up. It's right here. Because it's instant death if you don't miss time to jump. Well, that's at least is forgivable. But what's this? No! No! What's happened to us? We're now returned. We can't jump. That's useful, but I guess, but uh, um, really, really weird. No, 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 no. Hidden monkeys inside of um, snowman will just not do. Just will not do. Ow. Here's my least favorite part. Well, I get to destroy lots of blocks, so I can't complain. But, um, I have to be careful which blocks to destroy. See, I've already messed up. Okay, never mind. And. Items don't regenerate, so you could be sure that uh, that uh, you could destroy the blocks, come back in, and, and see whether if I come back or not. But since they didn't, it's fine. With us. That's why I hate this this area so much. It makes me just want to cheat. Brr. Does this have to be so hard? <sighs> Gah! Okay, I'm just gonna cheat. You have a jumping function for a terrible button on your jumping function. You can actually float up. <laughs> so that's that. Actually, I 
feel bad about doing that. But I don't, because I'm Batman. I usually don't fail so spectacularly. But that leaves me with no choice. Ah, and a secret door. I have no idea how this thing connects to each other on the floor. Maybe it's some sort of hidden uh, dimension, but more likely it's probably just rotary or something. I have no idea. Anyways, it's time for some whack-a-mole. We turn to a hammer. We have to whack the villains with other friends. It's hard to spot, because everybody's wearing a goddamn mask. Make sure you don't whack our friends, so you get a perfect score. Two more. One more. There we go. Perfect score. See, that wasn't too hard, was it? And what do we get for our troubles? From the Thieves Guild? From the Master of the Thieves Guild? Oh look, it's a loaded die. So we really are a dark hero. We all, we all, not only do we... Not only do we... Lagged. Not only do we uh, walk around with shameful, uh, shamefully and cheat, we also ah cheat uh, at the dice game. So the slaughtered down will net us either four, or five, or sixes. So we'll go first. Yes, pancakes. Full heal. Look, our opponent has significantly more, really more HP than we do. So either way, we either have to race him to the end. Or beat him to a pulp beforehand. Which is difficult, considering he has more HP than we do. What does that do? Picks up a card. Oh no! He gets to roll and see how many w tiles we walk backwards. So we walk backwards two tiles. Yes! P-Block. The monkey, the girl, or pa pa Young. Pa Young, with his smarts, will kill him! Yes! I'm getting tired of doing this voice. It has does not done a number on my throat. But he keeps getting sixes. What's the point of my ro loaded die if he also keeps getting sixes? Yes, power attack. And as you can see, power attacks are relatively useless against him. He's going to win. No. We must persevere. Payang. Do your best. He's almost dead. No. He's going to attack us. Only for one damage though. Which is fine. Yes. Just in time before he reached the goal. And that's the end of the Yeti. Up next. It's policeman. Oh! It's Booby again. So what should we be, man or beast? 
We'll have to find out next time. For this is I'm Biggie, and I'll be back. <laughs>